Sacked Australian cricket coach Mickey Arthur says Cricket Australia ignored his basic rights after axing him. Arthur, who returned to Perth today, denied he was responsible for leaking confidential information about his $4 million legal action. Mickey Arthur is back to defend himself. The damage to my reputation and career has been immense. After being sacked on the eve of the Ashes series, a South African was hoping for a private resolution with Cricket Australia. After my dismissal, I received nothing in writing from Cricket Australia, no, no contact and no payment at all, even on my basic leave pay, until I was forced to bring in lawyers to assist in the process. Arthur says he never wanted to launch legal action, but Cricket Australia left him with no option. Details of his submission to the Fair Work Commission were leaked to the media. Selective leaks by others have ruined my attempts to protect the Australian cricket team and everyone involved. The document contained details of a cancerous rift between Captain Michael Clark and Shane Watson, up to $4 million in compensation and claims of racial discrimination due to his nationality. Shane Warne has accused Arthur of sour grapes. Conciliation will take place in Sydney on Wednesday, Arthur with a message for his former pupils. Hopefully they can bounce back after a disappointing day yesterday and still bring the ashes home. I truly have a lot of good relations there and um, I'd really like to keep it that way. Peter Vlahos, Nine News.